I was right. Look at those painted walls. Well, of course we are. Figured that one out hours ago. It took you a while longer, but it's all right. It's all right? Who do you think? Perfectly all right. I'm the brain and you're the looks. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, you'd be surprised just how much is wrong. Just when I thought you were starting to... Oh, forget it. You're on your own. Oh, come on. I meant it as a compliment. Where are you going? So incredibly stubborn, exploring an ancient palace all by yourself. Of course, I would never do such a thing. Still no sign of her. How did she solve all these puzzles so fast? Let's see. How about if I align these discs? Turning discs. One of my specialties. Now, Evelyn can't be far, can she? Evelyn, oh, come on, don't be like that. I know you're not just the looks. I'm the brains, remember? I know these things. So, you no longer think I'm some sort of pretty-looking novelty item, sort of like your cap. You think my cap is pretty? Oh, uh, I mean, no. No, <laughs> of course I don't feel that way. Oh, very well. I can't stay mad at you now, can I? Come on. Use the stuff that's underneath that pretty cap of yours and help me solve this one. Oh man, another disc puzzle. Do we really have to solve this? Unfortunately, I think we do. Now, as you might have noticed, we've reached the heart of the palace. This, in fact, used to be Solomon's throne room, and I'm guessing his riches can't be far off. Is that an educated guess? All of my guesses are educated, Adam. Now, hear me out. These discs are oil pumps. They're connected by gutters to several oil basins in front of the throne. And, according to this inscription, igniting those basins should open a secret entrance behind the throne. Come again? Oh, never mind. I'll just solve the stupid puzzle for you.
solved. It's pumping oil to the basins. That's the first step. Now we also need to ignite them. Follow me. It worked, and still no sign of the Clairvaux. Looks like we'll be able to secure Solomon's treasure before they can lay their greedy hands on it. I sure hope so. Even though I enjoy your company, I would enjoy it even more if we wouldn't be stuck in all these ancient ruins all the time. That's kind of, well, sweet actually. Uh, A swimming pool? Solomon's greatest treasure was his ability to do the butterfly stroke? I doubt it. If I remember correctly, Solomon briefly worshipped false gods near the end of his life. This may be the sanctuary he built for them. And look, there's a doorway on the other side. There's still more down here. This is it. Evelyn, can you feel it? We are here. Remarkably enough, I think I can. Right. I should probably... You probably should.
it's a book? Of course it is. Why didn't I think of that before? Don't you see? Solomon's greatest treasure was his wisdom. Which means the whole Clairvaux operation is pointless since they're just looking for earthly treasures. You're right, they are. We should tell their manager this and make sure they leave this incredible place alone.